Hey guys, it's me, Deb, and welcome to Vlogarino's Vlogmas Day 3. And also welcome to me being sassy with this little guy. He's going to be here for a while because probably in every video because I just don't feel like doing my hair. So there's that. Also, I'm pre-filming these. So these are all being filmed in the same day, the same couple days. So I kind of feel like share because I have my, um, I have like a, I have a costume change um, all the time. This, this is not, I'm, I would stand up, but I don't want you guys to see my butt. So it says, this is here. Right? Okay. I love, that's one thing that you'll, that you'll learn about me. I love Christmas. I love everything about Christmas and I love the Christmas, um, just decorations and the sweaters, like the uglier the better. I usually try to get a sweater that has um, a dog in it because I'm just a dog person. Um, I love the hat wear, the finery, the fineries. I love all of it. The cookies, the constant eating, the piling on the weight, the Christmas movies, um, even the even the Hallmark Christmas movies, which are so which are so predictable and so ridiculous that there's that many people, that many women in the United States that that, you know, need to save their their family's Christmas farm or an inn that was handed down to them by their grandparents or whatever. So anyways, um, or somebody who, somebody who, who meets a, who meets like a, a, a prince and they suddenly fall in love and they're going to be a princess girl. I can never be a princess. I'm too, I'm too sassy for that. <laughs> so I am too sassy. So anyways, today I've, and as, as usual, I veer off subject. So today's topic is to share a memory of a recent holiday. I am going to share a holiday memory from this year. Um, this year, we had, I had gotten a, um, a message. I was in like a Facebook page messenger group and it was me my mom um my ex-sister-in-law and my new niece-in-law I'm gonna call her that because she just married my nephew uh Micah and her name is Alyssa and just just a wonderful gal um I typically wouldn't say the word gal but I know that Peter says it so now for some reason I just say gal a lot so um, I got this text, I got this, this message popped up and said, hey, let's do, um, let's do a girl's Christmas exchange, a girl's day in Christmas exchange. So we got together, the four of us here at the house, and we decided, okay, we're going to do it on um, a Sunday, okay, we're going to wear pajamas, Christmas, everybody wear p p Christmas pajamas, we exchanged names, we had like a $20, um, a $20 limit and we were gonna play some games and and eat and drink so and that's what we decided to do we were going to rather than have my mom cook because my mom loves to cook but it's just she's getting older and there's so much to it and I would say that I would cook however um, I wanted to give the I wanted to give the local local fire department a day off. So because if I if I cook, I don't know. It might not be the best. Like I could dump stuff. I'm real good at dumping. Like that doesn't sound good. But I'm real good at dumping stuff together and then mixing it and then and and it's a dip, you know, or putting stuff in like sometimes putting stuff in a microwave. So we had said, you know what, we're just going to get stuff out. So we were going to do a real nice like dinner, but then we just decided let's just do pizza. So it was pizza and then we had a charcuterie board and a whole bunch of cookies and just um, uh, veggie, veggies and dip, veggies and dip and, and all kinds of stuff like that. 
So, and I made a little cocoa bar that had hot cocoa and whipped cream and caramel sauce and crushed up peppermint, Bailey salted caramel um, drink to like put in there and then different different flavored creamers. So nice. That's where this guy came in and I made this for it on my on my Cricut Joy. That's the most I can do. So anyways, for now, it was so nice. And I had gotten the little props, like the little little props that you can put up like a mustache or like a hat or like things that ho, ho, ho. I I got those and then we played like a little, little um, word scramble, like word jumble things where you unscramble the word and they were all Christmas things. And I had, um, and I had little presents for everybody and it was so nice we just got together the four of us and we just and we and we played Christmas music and we talked about you know Christmases in the past and just what was going on now and um and we exchanged gifts now when we exchanged gifts I had pulled my mom's name and I was like wait a minute I said to my my ex-sister-in-law who I still love to this day is still is just a fam a part of, of the family to me um and I pulled my mom's name and I said to her I said hey Jamie can I exchange it with you because I got my mom I'm gonna I mean I'm gonna give her a gift on on Christmas so um, I don't want her name now so sure so I got Alyssa's name and and um Jamie got my mom's name come find out my mom had gotten my name so she didn't exchange with Alyssa she just kept my name so we we were all in our in our um cozy pajamas and our Christmas fuzzy socks and we just ate and we talked and we took pictures with though we took selfies with like the with the little um props that I had gotten and we exchanged gifts and the one and the one gift oh, oh it was so nice because um, Jamie, my ex sister in law, had gotten us, had gotten me, my mom, and Alyssa um, personalized ornaments made. And the one for Alyssa was of her and Micah. And at their wedding, they have two dogs, Moose and Max. And Micah surprised Alyssa with the dogs. They got married at this resort. If you're, if you know, if you live in Pennsylvania, Western Pennsylvania, then you've heard of the, um, Bedford, Omni Springs, Bedford Resort, Omni Springs Resort. It's in Bedford. It's really nice. Like it's, it's pretty high end, which I've never, so I've never stayed there. Right. But it's pretty high end. It's kind of expensive. So they got married there and Micah surprised Alyssa by having the dogs brought up and they had these little these little black bow ties on. Oh, they looked so cute. They looked so handsome. Brought them up and had a little photo shoot with them. So, Alyssa or so Jamie had taken that one of those pictures, got that made into an ornament and then took a picture of took a picture that I got a picture that I had taken of me and my dad when we went to um, this fall festival in Smicksburg, PA. And had gotten that made into an ornament. And the funny thing about that one is that that was the day that my father had, it was everything was supposed to be made by the Amish there. And my father, which are Amish, which are in America, which are in typically like in Pennsylvania, in like the Lancaster area or Lancaster area. And so my father picked up this one item and looked and it said made in China. And then he picked something up and it said made in China. My father was like, what is this? This is not, I've never heard of any a Chinese Amish. And if anybody who knew my father knows, he was, he wasn't quiet. Like he couldn't just quietly be like, what is this? This was made in China. He had to be like, this is made in China and cussing and this and that. So the guy comes over who owns place. He's like, I want you to get out. It threw us out. Threw us straight out. And my father's like, I will never, ever come back here. Okay, so there was that. And then on the same day, I got, um, we were eating lunch at a restaurant indoors. 
indoors. And I got stung by a bee. Indoors. <laughs> So there was that. So that's when I, I cried at first when I saw this because it's my father. But then I just started laughing because that's the day that my father got thrown out because of the Chinese Amish. And I got stung by a bee indoors. By an indoor bee. So there was that. And then my mom's ornament was of a picture of her and my dad when they went on their Alaskan cruise. And they loved that. They just... They had such a great time doing that so that was a very special part and we just took um, we just took pictures and we were going to watch um, Christmas Christmas movies but we were so caught up in just talking and it was so nice because my mom you know it's been tough for my mom my mom doesn't isn't a person who really it is emotional about a lot. Like she doesn't show her feelings. Like in this family, I'm really the only one that is emotional and shows my feelings. I'm overly emotional. Another reason probably why I love Peter Mont and his videos is because I'm just, I just show all my emotions and I'm just out there. But I think she really liked having, having people over and just, you know, talking about reliving memories and just making new ones and we had decided that we're gonna do it we're gonna do it again next year um and then af after we were done eating uh, my um my nephew Micah came over and his um and his brother he brought his brother over so we all just you know laughed and joked around and took a nice family picture and it was it was so nice just to just to have a time when my mom was just you know taken away from from her feelings you know of like this being the first year that my dad's not here and it was it was just really nice uh, we're definitely gonna do that next year again and also I mean it was the same thing with with um, Thanksgiving because it once again was the first Thanksgiving without my father so it's just going, going to be me and my mom here and she decided to invite two of our neighbors over who have been our neighbors for I've known them my entire life I'm 53 I've known them in my entire life and they're so they're two older people their daughter their their kids all live in different states and their daughter who does live the closest had COVID so she couldn't go over so they were gonna be alone so she just invited them over and it was just the four of us and we had a big dinner and we talked and laughed for hours and and just and it was so it was it was just so nice that to be surrounded by by people and all these good memories and then after after dinner Micah and Alyssa came over and we just hung out and talked and and it was just so it was so nice to just be surrounded by like I said just just um the good memories and and good friends and great family so those are two of my most recent that just came from this year and um like i said um we're definitely going to be doing the girls the girls day christmas day again because it was it was just so much fun and just so just made it just made my heart so happy to see my mom happy so that was two of mine. Um, so I look forward to hearing everybody else's, um, excuse me, Christmas or holiday memories, whether it be, you know, Christmas or Thanksgiving or, or Easter or whatever. I look forward to hearing about everybody else's and learning about my fellow fabulous, fabulous fellow vloggerinos. Um, and until the next video, I'm still working on an outro. <laughs> so until the next video, uh, everybody stay safe. Um, put kindness out into the world and you'll get kindness back. And Merry Christmas and a very happy new year to everybody. Stay safe. Bye guys. Love you.